In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a report in LaTeX over Leaf. This is actually very simple and you don't have to go from scratch by clicking New Project and clicking Blank Project. You can work from a template and be a lot more efficient, quicker and it will look much much better. And the way you can do this is simply once on the website you want to click Templates up here and then you want to search for Report in here. So once you click it, Search, there we go. There's a bunch of different reports over here. Just look for one that suits you the best, okay? So the template you like the best, you can of course open up each and every single template, let's say this one, and then you can view it as a PDF. It will open up this PDF file and you'll be able to view it what it looks like. Now, as you can see, it looks like this and you can even scroll down while it loads up. It has a lot of content, so it will take quite a bit of time. However, when it loads up, you can just scroll through it and see if that's what you need. If it's not, just look for a different one and you're gonna make that one. Now, once you find the perfect uh, kind of report, you can simply click on it, click open as template, wait for a few seconds, and then after a few seconds of it generating, it will open up this editor, okay? Where you can pretty much uh, change whatever you want to and make it your own report. Now, you have to first switch it from code editor to visual editor if you're not very familiar with the latex editors and you can then much much easier kind of make this and modify this according to your needs. Now what you want to do is of course just do it very simply. Um, look for whatever you'd like to change. So let's say this university is not the one we're looking for. You want to look for this exact same text here inside this page. So as you can see, it says over here, University. So let's say you want to do University of, uh, I don't know, Chicago. You, I don't know if that exists. And then you want to uh, simply click Recompile and it will change up here. There we go. Then you can look for the uh, second text, Faculty of Engineering and Green Technology. It's over here. You can change it and then you can change whatever you want, your logo and different things, okay? Now, of course, you just want to scroll down and change each and every single text. As you can see, you can change this text to your own, click Recompile, and it will change the text here in the PDF format as well. Now, if you want to change different images, here's how you do it. You want to click on the image over here on the left, and as you can see, uh, it will give you kind of a name of this image. So this is logo underscore utar.png, as you can see. Now you want to look for this over here on the left. So you know, look for this logo here on the left. As you can see, there we go. It's here, logo utar.png. You want to click on it. And over here, what you want to do is basically delete it, okay? Now you want to delete it or click upload, which is if you click upload, it will allow you to select a new file and a new logo to put in there, okay? So that's very valuable. And then once you delete that logo, if you want to put in your logo, you wanna go here where it says main TX. This is the main document where you wanna be returning to each and every single time. And then you simply want to insert that image by let's say clicking, there we go, uh, making an enter, clicking these three dots, insert figure, upload from computer, you want to select your image, there we go, click open, select your width and all the things over here on the screen, click insert figure and it will insert your own figure. Now of course you can then click recompile and it will change it according to how you changed it. In a second over here it will update, there we go, as you can see my image has been uh, kind of put in there. So that's pretty much it. That's how you can make a report in LaTeX Overleaf and edit it very, very easily without any prior LaTeX experience. I hope this video helped you out and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.